He caught a touchdown pass in Super Bowl 39. He set records at Rutgers, but despite being retired for seven years, Smith is still finding his way in life after football. It's a little bit of therapy, honestly. Um, I'm not the only one. A couple of my friends have said the same thing. Like They really zoned out and their wives were like, wow, I've never seen him so relaxed. Smith knew that his football career would one day end, but he never imagined that he would be tapping into his creative side later on in life. I knew uh, football was such a short window that, and I mean, the average career is three and a half years. You know, I came in the league at 23. Uh, I always knew like, okay, if I'm in my mid thirties or 30, oh, and I have a whole lot of life to live. He and his wife, Jessica, recently opened a new business together, Pino's Palette in South Plainfield, a place that welcomes people to come in and channel their inner artist, also providing the option to enjoy a drink while painting. His humble beginning helped teach him the value of a dollar. Put like this, like, you know, was I going hungry? No. Did I have a roof over my head? Yes. Um, we just didn't have a lot of money. Like, I was that free lunch kid. Uh, uh, my basketball sneakers were my school sneakers, you know what I mean, that sort of thing. He says Jessica helped him find the answers he needed. In South Plainfield, Brittany Boyer, News 12 New Jersey.